let's face it, man. The NFL sports and as a general, there's going to be beef. There's going to be talking. I think it just makes it better. And whether or not what he said was true, which is not obviously Cam Newton's a great quarterback. He's their franchise there in Carolina. But maybe there's something more to it than just, well, if I would have had a better quarterback. There might be something more to it. And you, you don't know what goes on in a locker room. You don't know what's said. Um, I saw them on the field yesterday, and, and the demeanor of Cam was just like, really, man, you said that. And I thought something was going to break out right there. It, it looked like it because Thomas Davis was right next to him, and Cam kind of pushed him to the side and said, hey, I got I to gotta squash this beef or what, what you said. And it seemed like at the end they both just went their own ways. And I'm sure, you know, again, I'm sure it'll be all right with them. Because they both were, you know, were, were a pretty formidable, du formidable duo there in Carolina for a few years. But uh, that's just sports. Sports, you're going to have that. And, and you're going to have people talking. And you got to have thin skin. And then if it does bother you that much, you just got to squash it and you move on. What would you say to Kelvin Benjamin about all of this? Um, just, you know what? It's football. And just, you know, re just do what you have to do. And, and tend to detail what you have to do to be ready for every Sunday, no matter what you said or whatever. I mean, a lot of times you're not going to like everybody that you work with and, and things are going to arise. But you're all you're out there for the same goal. And that's to win games. And um, I'm sure the next step for him is just, OK, that's over with. Now it's up to me uh, to be healthy, like I said before, and help this Buffalo Bill team win and, and be a formidable factor out there when I'm on the field. I know you're super busy. What, what else you got going on? And yeah, uh, with yourself. Well, I, I have a reading program and uh, it's a literacy program. You know, my last name is Reed. So uh, we started it in uh, the Boys and Girls Club, which I'm a Hall of Famer with the Boys and Girls Club, like Magic and J-Lo and Jim, Jamie Foxx and all these guys started in, in Boys and Girls Clubs. And they realized, you know, how important it was for their, you know, their success in life. Uh, and we use the game of football to to interact with the kids. 